Guess where I am? We've made it to San Francisco. Uh, this of course the wonderful Golden Gate Bridge. And back there, that should be San Francisco if I'm not completely mistaken. Pretty sure it is. I'm so lucky that it's such a gorgeous day. The weather could not be any better. There are actually whales. Uh, people are yelling to see whales. And I can see them with my eye, but I don't think I can see them actually on the camera. There you go. You saw that? It is so incredibly gorgeous here. It is so beautiful. And all this is free of charge. You can just come here. Oh, you want to. You don't even have to cross the toll road. At least not from the direction I was coming in. Okay, I also want to do a quick update on how the night went. I slept in this rest area right next to the uh, highway. Um, it was okay. woke up in the morning because people were cleaning the highway and I immediately moved the car and cleaned myself up a little bit. And now I'm here at the Golden Gate Bridge. There's a chopper that just flew underneath the Golden Gate Bridge. That must be fun. Okay, well, plan is to go now into San Francisco. Check that wonderful place out. Then go uh, to Sacramento and start heading my way back east. East Coast calling. But for today we will still enjoy beautiful California. Entering the Golden Gate Bridge. Alright, enough looking at the Golden Gate Bridge from afar. Let's drive over this thing. Fun fact, this bridge is actually a toll road in a southbound direction and after driving now over 5,000 miles across the country, it is the very first toll road I'm taking on this trip. They were supposed to send me a bill in the mail, but I never got one. Maybe they don't send it to out of state license plates, I don't know. Lucky me I guess. So this trip still remains toll free. But anyway, driving over the Golden Gate Bridge has a lot of symbolic value to me. Coming all the way down to San Francisco is so much further south than I had initially planned for this trip. Originally, the idea was just to drive from Philadelphia to Seattle and back. And now I've basically added this whole other trip when I drove along the ocean down here into San Francisco. And that's it. That's the Golden Gate Bridge. But I am certainly not complaining about it. I'm loving every second. Driving around here is pretty much exactly what I expected it to be. Hills everywhere and hey I'm back in a big city so there's traffic and stop signs everywhere. It's a harsh contrast to all the fun and free driving I've been doing on the open roads recently. But hey then I had a flashback to day number two of this road trip back in Michigan because here I found another camouflage car. With Michigan plates. I actually sent this clip of the camouflage car to one of my favorite car YouTubers, Matt Moran, and he used it in one of his weekly update videos. So that's pretty cool. But driving down famous Lombard Street here, uh, I have to say that this was all filmed long before the pandemic. There were less tourists than I expected to be, but it's not because of the virus. But let me quickly talk about why I'm not going any further south on this road trip, and instead we'll be turning around here in San Francisco and head back east towards Philadelphia. 
There are two main reasons for that. Number one, it's the time. Let's be honest, if I was to drive down to LA or to San Diego, I would drive the slow route along the ocean, I would stop everywhere, I would take a lot of pictures, I would take some days to actually explore the cities, and I'm already behind schedule, so there's just really not much time. And reason number two, I just want to have a destination for my next road trip. It's simple as that. That was Lombard Street. This may sound a little weird, but there's definitely some sense of sadness within me while I'm driving around downtown San Francisco. It's simply because turning around and heading back east now somehow signifies the upcoming end of this road trip. And I'm having such a great time here by myself and with the car. I don't really want this to end. Thankfully, as a little teaser here, I'll be running into many more highlights on this road trip when I make my way back towards Philadelphia. But for now, the plan is just to make a quick stop in Sacramento and then head towards Lake Tahoe from where on I'll make my way into Nevada. And with another look at the Golden Gate Bridge, I'll be ending this video early. Usually I try to have one video for each traveling day, but after seeing the whales and exploring San Francisco a little bit, too much more happened on this day. So I'll end it here with a little sneak peek for the next video. It's still day 12 on my road trip, and this happened when I was at a grocery store parking lot. I ran into a bear. It's a goddamn bear. <laughs>